Hi, I'm Jeff Hoffman, The Big Game Hunter. And I want to talk with you today about what you do if you accept a counteroffer. Now, I, I did an earlier video that laid out the pros and the cons of doing that. In general, I'm not a fan of it, but you know, there may be extenuating circumstances that make it the right choice for you. So this video is not designed to deal with the pros and cons of doing that. It's designed to deal with the instance where you've already made that decision. So I want to be clear about this one. Um, I believe the other one is a no BS job search advice video, and it's called Counter Offers, The Road to Ruin? Question mark. So if you decide that it's in your interest to accept the counter offer, and you did not, and you did accept the offer from the other firm, or for that matter, even if you didn't accept it yet and you got a counter offer and decide to stay, the right thing to do is to offer uh, apologies, uh, appreciation to them, um, say something to the effect of thank you so much for all the time that you put into it, into interviewing me and assessing me. Um, this is a great opportunity. I think this is not the right time for me to accept it. But why? You know, and, and you'll politely explain. And then from there, once you're done explaining, saying, look, I, I understand you might be caught short. I want to offer you a few recommendations of people who might be able to do this role for you. And then you give them referrals of people. Now, do this with recruiters. You know, if you're working through a recruiter to the job, don't give the referral directly to the company. Give it to the recruiter because, after all, the only reason you got to that company is through that recruiter. Let them make a living, right? You know, they lost a fee because you made this decision. Replace the fee for them. Don't give it directly to the employer. If you had the interview directly with an employer because you posted a resume, they contacted you, or you applied through an applicant tracking system or through networking, give the referral directly to them. But at the end of the day, you know, apologize, thank them profusely, and offer referrals to fill the job. This is Jeff Alpin. Hope you found this helpful. If you did and you're watching on YouTube, share it, leave a comment, click the like button, do something that lets people know it was worthwhile. Then go over to TheBigGameHunter.us and go exploring because there's a ton of content that you can watch, listen to, or read that will help you find work more quickly. You can also download copies of my books and guides to job hunting. Pay what you want for them. Again, just go over to TheBigGameHunter.us and go exploring. A couple of final things. If your current firm is trying to hire someone, send me an email at jeffalpin at thebiggamehunter.us. Let me know who to contact and whether I should mention your name. I'd love to help your firm staff positions. If we're not already connected on LinkedIn, send me a connection request at linkedin.com forward slash in forward slash thebiggamehunter. I accept connection requests from people worldwide, except if you're a third-party recruiter or in a country known for scams or spam. This is Jeff Alpin. Hope you have a great day. Take care.